is Rick uh, 2008 Sonata gonna just change the uh, tranny fluid um, so it's about four and a half quarts or so I'm not doing a flush just gonna change it it's just like changing your oil taking the plug out putting the plug back in um, so I'll show you that just a quick video okay so here it is right here Okay, so um, I used a 24 on it. It wasn't very tight, so it didn't take much. So, uh, let's see here. Grab a paper towel. I think I might just let it drop in there. I'm not gonna lose it. If it falls in there, so. It's, uh, yeah, it's not too bad, but tranny is, once in a while, it kind of shifts funky, so I figured it's the easy, cheaper thing to do. Well, kind of. 41 bucks for, uh, for the fluid. For like six quarts, so. So, hopefully it takes about five, four to five, but I got an extra one. So. That drain out and then basically you know whatever uh, whatever drains out is what you put back in so that's how you can tell how much to put back in you know to be safe put that same amount and then uh, after you run it run it I just drove this to the store and back so it's hot so the fluids hot so after that you want to when you check it um, you're supposed to put in neutral and then check the fluid so I'm gonna have my wife sit in there with the parking brake on and her foot on the brake and put it in neutral while I check the fluid. But yeah, you know, put the same amount in and uh, that'll be safe. And after you drive it, then you can go ahead and add more if you need to. Yeah, I don't know how much is gonna come out, but I'm not doing the flush, like I said, just the drain just the plug there okay so once that all drains out okay and of course you got a uh, jack stand under there um, what I'm gonna do though is I'm gonna lower it I'm gonna go ahead and lower it now so maybe I'll get more fluid out and then I'll put the plug back in all right and then if you can see but yeah so that's it right there so I'm gonna I'm gonna lift it up to kind of get some air flow and some vent a vent through there and then um, just get the uh, the funnel the long funnel that goes in there and put in put in your fluid all right uh, so I came out with uh, I ended up using this old pressure cooker deal here and I poured some out but it ended up coming to be um, what I took out obviously 12 cups 12 cups of fluid when I drained the tranny there um, so it ends up being three quarts so what I'm doing is and then I clean the I cleaned the funnel really good too I poured some of the old fluid through the funnel wipe it down but um, yeah so when you're pouring it in okay kind of leave a little air there because you see it started it bubbles up if you pour too much you know at a time so you go slow take your time so we got to move it like that and just pour in a little bits at a time so I'm going to do the, the three quarts and then go ahead and check it yeah so this is what the fluid I got. Uh, O'Reilly's 41 bucks. So um, you might get it. You might get it cheaper somewhere else. You know. But yeah, that's what I'm using there. So it just has the different 
different list of uh, cars and stuff. But yeah, it's uh, synthetic stuff. So I don't know when this was changed. There's no record of it. I've had the car, um, I think since December. And of course I had to put the different engine in it. So it took a few months there to do that. And uh, I, well, I don't know how long it was, but by the time I got it going and everything, maybe a month or so, I don't know. Just kind of work on it as I go type thing. Wasn't a. I had another vehicle. So, anyway. Um, but yeah, so I don't know when the flu has changed. It's not in the book. Uh, the owner's manual, they didn't write it down. So, about every 30,000 from what I heard. So, it's pretty easy. So, maybe in a, a month or two, I'm going to go ahead and do the same thing. Yeah, and also, uh, the, well, the drain plug. Like I said, this wasn't very tight. Um, the O-ring seems okay. Sometimes you might need a new one. But uh, yeah, this thing was really dirty uh, with like uh, metal, you know, fine shavings of metal and whatever. But yeah, you can see I wiped it. Wiped it nice and clean. I didn't use any cleaner, just the towel itself. If you want to use like brake cleaner or something, I guess that'd be fine. But, but yeah, that was pretty nasty. So I'm gonna go ahead and put that back in. Yeah. All right. Just go ahead. Uh, let's see. So that's the fluid. And then um, yeah. All right. So thanks for watching. All right. Bye now.